Hey everybody, Girl Loving Food, Juan Shinkatik here in the beautiful Sundial Books. Um, I'm going to talk to Jonathan, uh, the owner, and we're going to ask him some questions to learn about Sundial Books, what they have to offer, and what you can get here at Sundial for Shinkatik. Um, we've got a great selection of things from Shinkatik. So I'm going to flip it over. We're going to start talking to Jonathan. Hi, Jonathan. Hi, how are you today? Good. So what year was Sundial established? We started in uh, May 2007. Okay, and has it always been at this location? No, we were actually uh, a couple doors down uh, in what is now uh, a real estate office, the old brick building, uh, which originally back in the 20s was a bank, and also uh, we were in what is now the barbershop. We had both uh, buildings at the time. Okay, and um, what are your hours in the wintertime? Hours in the wintertime. Well, to start it off with, we are closed Tuesdays, Wednesdays, and Thursdays. Monday, Friday, and Saturday were open 10 to 5, and Sundays were open 11 to 4. Okay, and um, so everybody knows you're located here on Main Street, but what right. is the physical address? The physical address is 4065 Main Street. We're on the corner of uh, Main Street and Bridge Street, where the old bridge ran, right across the street from the Island Theater. Okay, awesome. So you guys have had this business for a long time. What's one of your favorite things to do with uh, Sundial Books? Wow, that's uh, a loaded question, as it were. We, we enjoy, of course, interacting with customers. Uh, we enjoy having in-store events, whether they be book signings, uh, poetry readings. Uh, sometimes we have musical events where we invite local artists uh, and not so local artists to come in and play. Okay, awesome. Awesome. And do you have any local events that you want to tell us about coming up? Uh, well, Death by Chocolate's coming up in February, and I think right now that's probably uh, the only major event coming up. We have... Uh, a lot of events throughout the year, and we're particularly loaded up during Pony Penning Week in July, of course, but this time of year in January, it tends to be a little bit slower, so we don't have a lot of events scheduled. Yeah, Death by Chocolate's my favorite. <laughs> you and a lot of other people. <laughs> yeah, you can't say no to chocolate. Okay, um, as far as, uh, do you carry like a selection of for just Shinkatik, or do you carry a, um, a little bit of everything for everybody? We carry a lot of everything. We have a good selection of new and used books and uh, we carry local art, we carry local books uh, by people like Kirk Mariner, for example, uh, Curtis Badger, uh, local authors we have, uh, Lily Cherix is one of our, our local authors. We also uh, carry Darcy Cole's uh, books on the folds and on the stallions and mirrors. We carry a lot of other products of her, uh, from pictures to magnets, that sort of thing. Okay. And calendars, in fact, uh, the 2024 calendar is about to come in this weekend. Oh, wow. Yeah. The 2024 calendar. Yeah, she, she's working at a feverish pace this year. <laughs> Sounds like it. She's awesome. Yeah. If anybody wants to follow that, DSC Photography um, is her uh, Facebook page, and she also has a website. But um, you, I also see music here. So you also offer yeah, music? Yeah, we sell uh, new CDs, used CDs. We also have new vinyl. And if we don't have it, uh, we can usually order it for you. Okay. So you said you have new and used. So you offer consignments? We don't do consignment. We uh, offer trade-ins. Okay. We also take, uh, as far as used books go, if you have used books you want to get rid of, uh, we also uh, give you store credit for anything you want to turn in that we take in from you. Okay. Awesome. And no consignment. Awesome. Uh, yeah, well, that makes sense. That totally makes sense now since I did something like that, or I know somebody that did something like that. Well, I certainly appreciate you. It's really windy outside, guys, so I was going to looking for some place to highlight for to do the... Um, uh, events. So I came into Sundial Books and I've been in here several times and enjoy uh, shopping here and looking around and a uh, great selection of the Misty books if anybody's interested in yeah, Misty. We do, we do have some signed copies as well. Signed copies? Yeah. They're a bit more than the regular copies but we do have some signed copies of Marguerite Henry's books. Awesome. I did not realize that. That is really cool. Um, okay, well, thank you, Jonathan. I truly appreciate this. And guys, if you're ever here on Chincoteague and you want a good book to take to the beach to read, come on in. Thanks for stopping in, and we appreciate everything you do. Now, for the announcements for this week. Uh, we'll be starting off with tonight, Monday the 23rd. I'm going to get this out here pretty soon. So, uh, the rocket launch was postponed from tonight to tomorrow night. Rocket Lab, um, 6 to 8 p.m. Uh, there's multiple places you can see the actual launch. You can see it, of course, from the NASA Visitor Center out there on 175 Chincoteague Road. Um, you can see it, uh, Queen Sound. Uh, that place fills up pretty quick. Um, my personal favorite, Curtis Merritt Marina. Um, 
most of the hotels have piers and places to look uh, so if you're at a hotel check that out uh, you definitely want to see one of our rocket launches I really hope this goes off this week because I love rocket launches and I hope to record it for you guys and if it's any other day this week I probably won't be able to do it um, anyway so that being said so tomorrow the 24th 6 to 8 p.m. I'll be at Curtis Merritt uh, so come on down if you want to see me at Curtis Merritt and be in the video um, also uh, Wednesday the 25th we've got um, at the Island Community House we've got from 8 to 9 the yoga uh, we've got from 1 to 3 the sit and stitch and I saw a picture on their Facebook page that looks like a lot of fun if you like to uh, do needlework or anything like that hang out with a bunch of friends make new friends highly recommend that one <coughs> sorry um and then from six to eight is the chess club um the uh wednesday the 25th also uh sandy sky we all love sandy sky if you've never been in her store definitely need to get in there i'll definitely be in her store soon too um she's got a paint night uh 6 p.m this wednesday at chatty's lounge and then um, also at Don's, uh, we have this uh, Chincoteague High School after prom committee is having a pancake supper at Don's from five to eight. It's eight dollars a person. Go on out, have some great pancakes, meet some neighbors, um, and have a good time there. Uh, Thursday, the Island Community House is having their senior luncheon at 11 a.m. I'll be there. I'm old enough. I'll be there. It's a lot of fun um, again you get to meet your neighbors get to see people you uh, normally wouldn't get to see uh, Thursday evening uh, from 6 to 8 at Black Narrows uh, Brewery over there on Chicken City you've got trivia night from 6 to 8 that's a really popular event here and you can try some of the really good beers over there I'm not a beer drinker but I can tell you what Black Narrows has some good beer um, and then Chincoteague Library on Thursday has at 10 a.m. They've got their Tales for Tots. Um, it's a great little program. They have fun with the kids, read them a book, um, and different people from the community come in and read them books. Um, Friday the 27th, again, you've got the yoga at the Island Community House. Um, you've got, oh, game day. Sorry, Thursday. Totally missed game day on Thursday from 2 to 4. You've got their game day at the Island Community House. Um, and then the yoga again from um, 8 a.m. till 9 a.m. And then the loft art auction online closes uh, this Friday the 27th. So if you were in bid for any of their artwork, uh, you definitely want to get in there and get that done. Uh, get that bid in so you win your prize or you, you win what you want. Uh, Island Theater this weekend, 7 o'clock uh, is the Clerks for Friday night. And then Saturday um, is the pickup for the loft art auction items. You pick that up at the Island Community House. And Saturday night uh, at uh, the Island Theater is Clerks, Clerk 3. Never heard of that movie, but anyway, that's it from 2 to 7 p.m. And Monday the 30th, you've got uh, from 8 to 9, again, you've got the yoga at the Island Community House, Nana Cafe, next week's lunch. We're going to have an indoor barbecue. We're having hamburgers and baked beans. Um, always a good event. Always fun. And then uh, at the uh, Chimney Cultural Alliance, you've got the senior bingo at 1 o'clock uh, next Monday evening or afternoon. Um, upcoming events for February, of course, we've got the... Um, the wonderful the death by chocolate I'll be there um, walking around town collecting chocolate and um, there's uh, the food pickup at the island community house or at the island baptist church is going to be the 16th of next month so I think that's it for this week guys I hope everybody has a wonderful week um, thanks for tuning in if there's anything you guys uh, have as suggestions or recommendations for me please let me know I'm here to help you. Um, I am still in the midst of uh, making a list of the uh, pony tour boat tours and fishing tours for the boats and where to pick them up and how to get reservations. I'll also be doing um, the kayaks and uh, water type sports, uh, where to get that and bike rentals and somebody suggested uh, things to do with your dog because dogs are not allowed on Chincoteague National Wildlife Refuge. You will see them, and it will make you mad, but they're not allowed. So if you're bringing your dog to Shinkatee, please don't take it to the refuge. It, it's, it's very 
dangerous for um, the wildlife there to have your dog on that island. So guys, girl loving food on Chincoteague, have a great week and I'll be on the lookout for the rocket launch videos and any other videos I decide to do. Take care. Okay gang, hello again. Totally forgot to announce um, special orders for Valentine's Day. Okay, first of all, Valentine's Day and Death by Chocolate are not the same weekend this year. Um, weekend uh, Death by Chocolate is the 17th and 18th and the um, Valentine's Day is Tuesday the 14th, so it's right be right after it. So anyway, for Valentine's Day orders, we've got Anna Breland with her ALB macarons. Oh, baby. You want to talk about heaven? Mm -hmm. She's making uh, some for me this week. I can't wait to share them with you guys. They're going to be little otters. Um, but if you want to give her a call, 757-894-4528. 757-894-4528. Get those orders in because she'll be stopping them soon. Uh, Becky's Truffles and Treats. Oh, her caramel slabs. Mm -mm -mm. Good stuff. And her truffles literally melt in your mouth. Her phone number, 717-446-3179. Um, White Raven's Nest. They've got a heart-shaped Delmonico steak that you can special order. I've had that. Very, very good. They're also doing strawberry boxes with strawberry chocolate-covered strawberries. Um, they've got their um, mini and full-size Smith Island cakes. And they also have their ugly pies. And I think they're doing a couple other things. So check out their webpage or their Facebook page. And their phone number is 757-894-4664 or see their Facebook page. Um, Jennifer House from Having a Meltdown. She's doing a special order for cheesecakes. Definitely give her a call too. Um, and then Vanessa Cakes is doing her Smith Island cake. She has the uh, Smith Island cake recipe that if you've ever been to Ray's and I think the village and ordered their Smith Island cake, you have had her food. And sorry, the sun just went crazy on me. Anyway, um, her phone number is 757-894-2274. So, there you go. And also, Bill's is taking reservations for their Valentine's Day. And um, I'm sure Don's is too. Uh, Valentine's Day, again, weekend. Uh, limited options for sit-down restaurants. Pretty much Rope Walk, Bill's, Don's, Steamers, Chicken Diner are going to be your sit-down options um, for both Valentine's Day and Death by Chocolate weekend. So keep that in mind uh, for your din dining options here on Chicken all right, guys, girl, loving food on Chicken signing off until tomorrow for Rocket Launch. Keep your fingers crossed.